So if you want to take out that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. If you want to do it, you let's do it. Let me know, buddy. That is not a crime. And you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse! I don't know you! Spit me on my face right now! Keep spit in my face! Our video today takes us to Santa Fe Springs, California, where we find a pack of wild hyena hood rats harassing people working for a living. Of course, that's what these wild hyena hood rat frauditors do. They can't get a job of their own, so they harass people who do have a job. Perhaps they're jealous that everyone's working except for them. Enjoy. Viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. How you doing? Hello? Hello? Where are you guys from? Where are you guys from? Pardon me, sir, but this is a group of narcissistic sociopaths. And they use the silent treatment to make you think that you're crazy. And when they do speak, it's in some type of foreign language that nobody can understand because it's not a language. I'll give you an example. Salam yalla handula. Alu akbar. Haknui kanda kra. Ula wala fufatai. Five minutes later. Yeah. Hello, hi, I'm Levi Moniz. How can I help you? What are you guys doing? Oh, fucking weirdos. This is the life of an uneducated, unemployed frauditor, most of whom who have arrest records. They get up every day about noon, they sit around the house for a while, and then they head out about 2 o'clock in the afternoon and stick a camera into people's faces who are trying to earn an honest living. This is what they do best. A few moments later... The idiot that we're looking at right now goes by the moniker SGV News and we have seen him in handcuffs on more than one occasion. Oh, I bet his mommy's so proud of him. Yes, indeed. The working man told the frauditors to get a real job and called them bums. That's exactly what they are. 
Who's going to hire these guys? Look at them. Oh, but that's the sad part about our society. Somebody would hire them, and we'd be stuck with them. They'd probably be our ch checkout person or cashier. Oh, my gosh. Hey, you're fucking keeping, dog. Stop. Shh. 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 Hey, let me get him on live on Instagram real quick. he wants to do what we're doing believe me frauditor no one wants to do what you're doing all day he's simply taking a picture of you so later on when they're sitting around having a few beers they can remember you and laugh at you and poke fun at you what a pussy fucking all that shit what a little bit what's up boo? what's up He's whispering, what's boo? up what's put up down the camera what's up put down the camera what's up what's up boo? what's up, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up then? What's up? Put down the camera. Put down the camera. What's up? Put down the camera, homie. You think I'm fucking scared or what? I don't even put down shit. What's up? What's up, boo? You shouldn't even be recording me, dog. Who the fuck told you to record me? Who told you to fucking record me, dog? Who gives you the fucking right? Who are you? Who are you then? Who are you then? Bounce? Bounce? Nigga, you bounce. I'm fucking work here. This is a daily routine for me, dog. What are you talking about? Bounce. Bounce. You bounce. Bounce. I don't believe in fat shaming anyone because we all have a couple extra pounds here and there. But I always make exception in the case of frauditors, especially Glenn Serio. And I'm going to make an exception for this F, F, F guy. Yeah, that's abbreviated because I can't say those words on YouTube. But he's a tub of lard and he would definitely bouncy bounce. You're high as shit. Get too. away. Shut the so fuck up. Hey, guys, you're an idiot. Right, guys, hey. you're go. You're an idiot. Well, I'm gonna call yeah. the cops right you're now. Cops are coming. You're harassing. You're harassing. Cops are coming. You're harassing. You're harassing me. Why don't you leave me alone? Cops are coming. Why don't you leave me alone? This is a place of business. I don't talk to you. You talk to me. This is a place of business, alright? Leave me the fuck alone. This is a place of business. And besides, you're on the street. Leave me the fuck alone. Watch out, man. Don't touch me. Watch out. Get the fuck off me. Yeah, what are you doing? Watch out. Push me. Back up. Back up. Push me. 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 Back up. Back up! Push me! Back up! Back. Do it! Keep touching me! Keep touching me! On, Keep touching me! Keep acting like an idiot. Fucking smack that fucking camera! What do you mean? He touched me! Can you tell us anything? These frauditors are real tough guys until somebody touches them or possibly their camera. Whatever you do, don't touch their camera. You have no reason for being here. Can you explain? You're hiding behind that mask. Yeah, I don't want you to see my face. Fuck you. You ain't gonna do shit. Fuck you. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. Go on. Go on, guys. That's cute. I didn't touch you. Fuck you. You got a bunch of people witnessing that you're gonna go to jail, dog. Yeah. Just remember that shit. That's fucking what you're doing. What are you gonna do? Breathe all hard? You ain't gonna do shit. Remember that shit. Right? You're good. That's cute. That. What is that? Pepper spray? It's harassment, and on top of that, this motherfucker's getting yeah. like, do it. Like he wants to hit me. Do it. it. This entire crew of California frauditors always carry pepper spray. But I've seen at least they've changed the pepper gel because the gel is a little more stable in a windy condition. Now, while it is legal to use pepper spray in California, you got to have a small canister of it. And the police still look down upon people who use pepper spray. You have to be in a life-threatening situation. You have to fear for your life. And I don't think this situation would be life-fearing. That's aggression. That's aggressive. You're a pussy. That's all that. You're a straight pussy. That's a warning. Warning. Fuck you. You're a pussy. Walk away, little bitch. You're a pussy. Walk away, little bitch. I mean, over here pushing people. Who the fuck you I think you are? I didn't touch no one. Who do you think you are, man? Did I touch you? Who do you think you are? You my bitch. This motherfucker. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Seems like you're the only bitch around here. Coming up all huffy and puffy and you don't do nothing? Yeah. That's a fucking bitch. You got bitch. a camera. You're hiding behind a camera. That's a bitch. 
I'm not hiding Easy behind money. anything, motherfucker. Easy money. I'm not hiding behind nothing. We'll I'm see you. I'm behind a crybaby like you. There's only one crybaby frauditor, and that's you. Has anyone ever seen SGV News get flattened or punched around? Because I would love to see that video. Oh, I'd love to critique it. If you have any links to his videos where he gets pushed around, please put them in the description box or send them to me directly at my email. I would love to preview that. Hey, stupid. Trying to get easy money. Don't want to work. Little hey, bitch. It's better than being a slave. Go slave. Go earn your hourly wage. Salary. Go clock in and clock out. Salary. Let me know when you're done. I don't. I don't need to clock in for shit. Let me know when you're done. Motherfucker. I got you. Oh, your baby boy's gonna hold you back. You got a babysitter now. You got a babysitter. I get out at 3:30. You got babysitter. Who's the babysitter here? You're a babysitter too. It's unfortunate that this frauder has grown up to become a sickly man-child. And that's what he is, a sickly man-child. And what I mean by that is mommy and daddy didn't pay enough attention to him when he was a youngster. And this is what has transpired in life now. He's a brat. He's a grown-up brat. Oh, the poor little boy. What's wrong with all your gangster ass fucking work? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's wrong with you? Bunch of thug ass lame ass fools right here. Exactly. You're retarded. Who you employ? You employ thugs here? Look, there's your babysitter. There's your babysitter. Hey, go handle that baby right there, man. Go tell him to shut up. Tell him to keep his mouth shut. Shut up. Hey, you can't even hear him. Don't you know what the fuck you're doing? Don't you know what the fuck you're doing? Don't you know what the Okay. Pardon me, good people, but these idiots are here only to harass and provoke you into a confrontation. This translates to clicks and views on their YouTube channel, which also translates to big dollars. Look, your babysitter's back. Let's go. Babysitter's back. All right, let's go let's inside, go. everybody. Why don't you go have all your babies in here, man? Yeah, tell everybody to go back inside. Well, everyone's wondering what you're doing. We're out here getting food Get from lunch, our truck. Man. I'm not stopping you. I asked you 15 this times. This is constitutional you... protected activity. You cannot interrupt what I'm doing out here. So leave me no, alone, no, no man. No one said we Just could. Just leave me alone and do what you got to do. You definitely have a weapon on your head. That's right. Definitely have a weapon on you. You don't even have a badge, right? Yeah, you have a fucking weapon. <laughs> you don't have a bad guy. This is know what he's talking about. This one does not know what he's talking about. You're fortunate, frauditor. If this man's friends hadn't held him back, you'd been flattened already. You'd have been laying on the ground thinking, what just happened? This guy. We're asking you why you're why are you asking why are you filming us? That's none of your business. How is it none of our business? Because it's not. Straight out. All right, let's go. Hey guys, have an amazing day. Thank you. Go be a babysitter, man. Go teach you something. Much bigger men than you are, bro. This was mad still. This was mad. Talk your shit with his purple phone. Nice purple phone. Well, there you have it, folks. After the workers go back inside and close the gate, the frauditors stick around for about another 10 minutes and harass the people through the gate, making threats and accusations. What is wrong with these frauditors? This is all they can do? Well, apparently so. You know, it's tough to get a job when you have an arrest record and you have very little education. I'm not making fun of people. I think they should be able to get a job and do a decent day's work. They just don't want to get out there and find a job. That's what the problem is. If you enjoy watching idiots, imbeciles, and morons on my channel, please subscribe. As always, thanks so much for stopping by.
cheers to that.